evening, friends. My name is Sima Hearn. I'm the Business Office Director for Wildwood Senior Living. And sitting beside me is my son, Logan. Uh, he is 10 years old. And so he is helping me tell you all my why that I will be taking the uh, vaccine for COVID-19 when it becomes available. And yes, he is my why. Um, he is loves to play uh, baseball. He loves to play video games with his friends. Um, he loves to spend time with his friends. And so last year, um, he whenever the schools closed down and we had to do virtual learning, he did not do very well because he liked to be with his friends and he liked to be with his teachers and um, he focused better when he was with in a classroom setting. And so um, he just did not thrive very good with virtual learning. And so this year, whenever they gave us the choice of either sending your child to school or doing virtual learning, we decided to take the risk um, because most of all, <clears throat> I want m my son to have a normal childhood education. I want him to play with his friends at recess. I want him to sit in front of a teacher and um, answer questions in a classroom. I want him to get in trouble, um, but you didn't hear me say that. <laughs> um, so the thing is, is that I want him to have a normal childhood um, in the realization that and sending him to school, the reality is a lot different because you go back and forth between quarantine and not quarantine because of exposure, not exposure. Um, and so it was never going to be normal. It was never going to be the same. And in order to get to that normal and to get to where he can have a regular childhood, if that means that, that this vaccine is the answer, then I'm going to be first in line to do it. Um, because I am looking out for his future. When you become a mother, you uh, uh, take that unspoken pledge of you're going to do whatever it takes for your child. And, and this is the first step, I think. Um, so sometimes instead of listening to our minds and asking too many questions, I think that we need to follow our hearts. And he's mine. So that is my why. Thank you for listening. And uh, I hope you all follow your hearts as well.